Okay, just a set of sides and back for a guitar on Brazilian rosewood sells for this much, right? Now, before in the past, you had to have inaccuracies like this. Here we can see from the fourth to the third string, a huge gap, and then from here to here again. Then this is, I like quote that because it's a typical Gerundino guitar, which 1942, and if this does not, any guitar, this is the traditional Cypress guitar per excellence. So this is one among the things which now we don't have because now we have this perfection of bridge there on a guitar, along with all consistency necessary, but a very important thing here that you can customize it. Look at this three made with two different woods, the Nashberry and then the Cocos wood on the, on the neck of the guitar. This is with Widner pegs, look at this. This is apart from the, from the triple fretboard, which you can see here, with the flag of Spain in this side. This is one part, this is another part, and this is another part. Seems like if it has more guitar, right? more strings. So this is triple, and then it has a double fretboard. And this is the triple fingerboard. This one here is in radius, for example, but about this selection of the wood, I wanted to see one of the most marvelous sets of Brazilian rosewood. You can see, and this here is the guitar of my friend Eric. And very interesting to observe also that the, this system of circulation of air, and this one has the sensor of Carlos Juan installed that he kindly came today installed it here and of the most sophisticated kind of that kind and well inside the, there is no bouncing of bad bouncing of sound uh, that we can very easily see comparing it with my top model uh, guitar from the past, because this here has no, although it has a structure, it is of plain wood, right? As compared to the new circulation air system, which is very much superior this year. Very much superior. What do we have here? Let me see if I can put this with, with more light, probably. And yeah, look at this. So, a marvelous idea, and there is no ba bad bouncing, neither as well, because it maintains the equilibrium. So that is regarding selection of woods, because now you could get wood to select from here in AG. Like for example, look at this set. This is back on sides. And then number 16. Uh, for example, 13, then another fantastic set of Brazilian rosewood, of which there are about 10 types. We have 14 here. Mm, 17 of different kinds. And now, of course, look at this. A fantastic set of wood. And you can customize it as you like. So from the past, you have to swallow whatever is there that the luthiers want us to swallow. Or on darker, on darker wood as well. So this is very important. Apart from the balance feature,
the instrument. Here you don't need to put any pressure on the forearm here, pushing this or having to hold it with the left hand, which means it's designed for horizontal posture. So these facts here are crossing the and then, uh, then this means something. Then of course there is also fretless, balance, negra. But this balance aspect of the means that you also. can have it place here, and I don't need to be pushing with the right hand or holding it with the left hand. So what does it mean? It means that it takes totally the tension from those two aspects. So this was the dream of Paco de Lucia. In fact, it was his. That's a great thing. So and then, of course, woods. Then when once you make it, then it becomes this, like these examples. This is the other uh, other way of triple and non just flat fretboard. This is triple fingerboard with three woods. That is the Nashberry and Maple. This is a comfortable playability. The maximum look at this here. It's a marvelous thing. And then, of course, in the line of Negra, right? Negra, of which I recommend a lot the Whitney Pegs. And then we have the Cotaway guitars. So that then we have, with this much reach, to to go. And of course, as a distinction from the from the first ones, this also may be made in Brazilian rosewood, right? Like this here, like this other negra with red cedar top, which is a softer wood and has this, this sides and back. So, this fortunately enough. Now we can, well, if you read this thing here of the new redefinition of the guitar, the article, then you will find different things. And because all, all based on, on Barbero, things all based on Barbero. Right? So, for example, of this of Barbero here we have right, the marvelous guitar, of which Paco had three of these. I have seen like five in my life, two belong to Gino Dauri. So this was here in an, in an auction, it's in an auction in Christus Gallery. So therefore, but if you see because of what you're getting, if you ever dream to have a, a real authentic Brazilian Rosewood guitar, this is your chance here with this ultra convenient offer by AG. One, just one year after their 20 year anniversary in 2020. Thank you.